Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a good one today. I'm the Metal Junkie, and today I'm returning the to Tool. I'm checking out the song Opiate. This is off of their first EP before they even released a studio album, so that's going to be interesting. Um, a buddy, a work buddy of mine, suggested uh, I check out this EP or at least this song to see where the band started, and I'm super interested to see uh, how they sound. So we're going to dive right in. As usual, I know nothing about the track. I've done three other Tool uh, reactions at this point, so go check them out if you're interested, and let's go. Choices always were a problem for you. What you need is someone strong to guide you. in a sec first thoughts um the core sound of tool is kind of still there you still kind of kind of hear it in there but this is definitely a little bit more standard it, it's a little less progressive than the other tracks i've heard a little less intricate but still very well done like i'm really enjoying this i like the the sections of the song i like the singing the bass is really sticking out to me on this one especially the way it started and that section we just got with the drums very cool um the section that just came in with that da -da -da -da, that felt a little bit more like the tool i've heard on the other song so uh interesting to see where they came from on their the first ep but i'm totally digging it and you could already tell that they're they're gonna have a bright future like you can just hear it jesus harmonic pitches on the bass if you want to get your soul to heaven trust in me now don't you judge or question see that part's kind of sticking in my head he's been saying that a lot like uh trust in me if you want to go to heaven and stuff like that it's catchy like i'm already grabbing it we're only not even three minutes into the track I find that it almost has like a grunge feel to it this song I feel maybe it was just from the time it was released early in the 90s but yeah you could you really feel that I think this was early 90s I didn't check the date but uh early 90s late 80s whatever it was but you really do feel that 
it's more than alternative if you feel a grunge factor in there i feel anyway and and also like i said the band just seems to be a little less progressive than the other tracks i've heard which kind of helps in that regard but i'm totally digging it and like i said this the vocal lines here are really great get your soul to heaven trust in me now don't you judge or question you are broken now but faith can heal you just do everything i tell you to do I think that pretty much sums up what the lyrics are about to me anyway um about someone down on their luck and they're kind of like questioning jesus or god or whatever the lord to like why aren't you helping me i'm in bad shape right now and then you see the other side of the coin like don't question uh, like just go with the flow and be a good person and you will end up in heaven but don't question his authority or the way he works pretty interesting subject matter and it kind of goes along with this cover here which pretty really cool uh, cover art uh, for this single but I i'm digging it Let let's continue it this part back wow that really caught me off guard there saying that uh his will his he has needs like me and we both want to rape you or something like that very interesting i think this goes along with don't question the way god does things even if he does bad things like you know very weird um it's very interesting and it definitely makes for a great discussion but yeah wow and that that, that little yell that he did There has to be more more of this track. <laughs> There's like three minutes left. There has to be more. We're going to wait. <laughs> Definitely more than just grunge, though. You're starting to feel the tool come out of this song as the song was going along. Definitely some metal parts in there. Um, especially with the that crazy drumming we just got, like I always call it like tribal drumming when they play like, doo -doo 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 -doo. very cool. Um, the bass and drums definitely stick out on this track. Here we go. This is on your lighter. 
bit messy all over the curtains. Armchair covers, throw pillows and carpet in. <laughs> bizarre track uh especially the ending <laughs> um it it's a different side of tool i never seen before where they're kind of just playing around just fooling around and a friend he did acid <laughs> it's just it was really funny and bizarre just not what i was expecting at all um yeah just kind of like a little hidden extra in there at the end but as for the real track opiate o opiate um, like I said, it started off more of your standard um, grunge alternative song, but as it was going along, they were definitely adding some metal el elements in there. It was getting crazy. Uh, the subject matter is really interesting, um, uh, you know, being about religion and how far will you go for your religion, basically, and just dif different ideals and just, you know, kind of... Uh, dissecting religion and really starting to question and that and how <laughs> I'm not going to go too deep in this but how um, they don't want you to question you know because they don't always have the answers but it's just very interesting nothing against anybody religion or not I'm just talking about the song itself but the song was really interesting it was catchy in that respect and like the chorus part and yeah, I just really dug it. It was just something very different with a very, very bizarre ending, I might add. But yeah, very interesting. Another check in the tool journey for me. Um, I'm glad I'm getting to see all different sides of the band. Uh, that's where you guys come in. Always drop more suggestions down below. I'll be glad to take them. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching.